Alright, this is Paul, and today I'm bummed, so I thought I would do a little PSA about um, the importance of polymeric sand if you have pavers or uh, interlocking pavers like we do. So, uh, about five years ago, or ten years ago, I installed this, nine to ten years ago, and then this is sat for five years on this brick and the elements. And you can see, once you use polymeric sand, it's extremely hard to get off and sand loss during a rainstorm doesn't happen. So you can see it's just really great material. It's much more expensive than regular sand for pavers, but it's a wise investment. So definitely always uh, pay for that if you um, get a lot of water in your pavers or you're concerned with sand loss, like if your driveway is on a slope or anything like that. So anyways, over the summer, two months ago we had um, our driveway re-sanded and resealed and it looked pretty good uh, we did a video earlier and the sealant defoliated our tree but that's life the trees coming back so not too concerned about that other than it just doesn't look pretty right now um, so anyways you could tell that um, we paid extra money for the polymeric sand but this is definitely not polymeric sand so uh, we're currently in the middle of them resolving this issue so I'm not gonna name the company or anything like that because it's not cool but either way I just wanted to do a PSA on the differences between uh, polymeric sand and in this case here this is uh, sand that had not enough sealant and this is one rainstorm just turned the sand which was hard it was hard um, but anywhere in the joints it just didn't have enough sealant to bond and so um, this is just regular sand here so polymeric sand is by far superior. Um, you can see our original driveway had polymeric sand, so you can see that there's still some hard parts here they couldn't remove when they resealed it. I just wanted you to see that there's definitely a difference between polymeric sand, which would be here, see what's left, or this could just be also sand that's been really hardened with proper amount of sealant, versus this is what happens when you do not apply enough sealant, and one rainstorm will turn your uh, joints, the interlocking pavers, the sand joints into, it's like play sand for kids. So there you go. Give us a like and a subscribe and wish us luck. And I hope the company does us right and fixes this problem. Um, but either way, I hope you learned the difference. So go with polymeric sand and it will not cause you problems. All right, take care. Dude, it's creepy.